We're here doing first and ten with Dolphins rookie linebacker Jordan Tripp. Uh, he's not, he doesn't have a preference whether you call him Jordy or Jordan, but he'd like to be referred to as Jordan right now. Jordan, hardest thing in football to do is what? Um, I'd say just learning the playbook first thing coming in. Uh, you know, it's obviously a lot more complex. You just got to stay focused. I'd say that's the hardest thing. What? How much more complicated than a college playbook? A lot. You know, I actually had a pretty co uh, complicated defense in college. I've had three different defenses, but none, none as complicated as this. Okay. Player you grew up admiring and why? Uh, Walter Payton and uh, his work ethic. Were you ever a running back? Yeah. Is that why you liked Walter Payton? No, just because his work ethic. Okay. Most influential person in your career was who? My father, for sure. Why so? Um, you know, he's always been a hard worker and uh, told me if you want something, go and get it. You're going to have to work for it. So those kind of go hand in hand. Best Christmas present Jordan Tripp has ever gotten is what? Shoot, when I was... I think first grade I got like a little 50cc motorcycle and I thought it was the coolest thing ever. I just it, started it, in the house. <laughs> what grade? First grade. First, so first grade you got a motorcycle? Yeah, I started. I used to ride motorbikes. Uh, okay. First job Jordan Tripp ever had was what? Scrubbing semi trucks uh, in our shop and doing fence out of our ranch back when I was in fourth grade. And the hardest part about that was what? The heat in the summer inside, scrubbing them in the steam. And how old were you when you did it? Fourth grade. Fourth grade? Mm -hmm. Good God. Child labor laws. We work laws. up in Montana, man. I, I hear you. The, there are child labor laws, you know. Nah, I'm just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> well, how much you got paid for that per day? Oh, shit, I don't even know. Like five bucks. Five, five bucks an hour or something. <laughs> okay. What's playing in your car right now? I don't know, something about Toby Keith or George Strait, something like that, something country. Something country, and your favorite country album is what? I don't even know. I just listen to country. I don't have albums. <laughs> oh, okay. Nobody buys albums anymore? Nah, I guess not. <laughs> Place you'd like to travel to and why? Mm, I'd have to say Alaska. I want to go, um, I, you know, down the road, want to go like snowboarding up there, go hunting up in Alaska or something like that. But isn't Montana like right there? Uh, no, nah, it's quite a ways away. It's like 14 hours. You got to go all the oh, way through Canada. Got to go, okay. <laughs> I forgot about the Canada it's, aspect yeah, of a it. a little buffer in there. Uh, best meal you've ever eaten is what? A steak dinner um, out at our ranch from one of the cattle that we had. So just fresh, fresh meat. Does fresh, fresh beef. beef. Beth, fresh beef tastes different, different than what you can get in the store. I'd have to say so, yeah. That's interesting. Now, final question, first and ten. One player to have you back in a bar fight, who would it be and why? Yeah, without a doubt, Jason Trusnick. <laughs> Is it because he's sitting right over there? Nah. <laughs> he's just a guy we want. You want to have a dark alley fight. He'd have your, he'd have your back. Gotcha. Appreciate it. Thanks, sir. <laughs> Thanks.